All right, we are back with this first War of the Spark draft video, uh, Spike Games as usual, and we lost our first one. It was very sad. It was another green-white deck. Uh, not going to dwell on that. We got match two coming right up here. All right, so we get an opening hand, and the opening hand is great, so we will keep it. This is actually one of our best hands, because we get to go two drop apparition into give it a counter, do some proliferating, so that's going to be fun. He's got a one drop, on maybe the red black sack deck, looks like it, yep. Mm -hmm. Here's this guy. We could have played this, actually, but I think I just want to get this combo assembled as fast as possible. Let's see what the opponent has here. Hopefully not removal. That would be sad. Nope, just a 1-2-3 curve. That's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. All right, we have this to gain some life too, so I think we'll be fine doing Shangyangu and then these two next turn. Hey there, let me know if you find any cool leaves or best stuff. Jiang also technically gains us life because you know if they're like this will proliferate onto Jiang too. So this is an infinite chain if they don't disrupt it. So they pretty much have to kill Jiang. I hate this guy. He's so strong. I'm very scared of him. Yep. Sean gained me three. I'll take that. This guy still proliferates itself too, so opponent needs removal pretty quick. Alright, so we play the green source. Uh, we bond first in case we draw a better two drop. I don't think we will, but... Uh, we want the Grizzly, for sure. And then we will attack. Whenever opponent decides to let us. Alright. Mm -hmm. I wonder if we just naturally win this race. I don't think we do, but with, with the blockers coming down, I think we'll be okay. Opponent really needs removal for this. If opponent does have removal for this, it's pretty bad. But we will see. Please, no removal. That is not removal. We will have a good chance at drawing removal, though. It's like top something, so it probably means it was removal. Unfortunately. So I'd love to draw a Ketra at some point. Still haven't drawn her once this entire draft, so. Here we block three, four, five, six, seven. Hmm. If we block this guy, he'll have a he'll have a two two. we block this guy, it'll prevent one more damage. I think we want that. Guess if he drew a two mana spell, this is dangerous. We can just kill our snare spinner, but what are you gonna do? Ow. All right. That's a pretty good draw, actually. Holds back his whole board. And then it'll force him to make the choice on the removal, too, which is good. Mm -hmm. Here's a big dude. What you got? All right, if 
the opponent doesn't have removal here, I'm going to be shocked. The question is, which of these will opponent remove? Okay, that's not removal. Neither is that. Wow. Hmm. Does opponent now attack is the next question. Opponent's on a two-turn clock because we'll hit for five and then proliferate and then hit for six. So, yeah, I think they have to attack. I think that's right. How do we just prevent the most damage possible? So... Okay, so this can block here. And then this, he has two mana open, so this can do six to us by sacking two other creatures. So if we block here, and if that happens and I block it, this dies, which I think is bad. So I think we just accept that we're gonna take seven here and we kill this thing. Yeah, I think that's the play. We'll take seven if he sacks two creatures, which he probably should. Ah, uh, right. I forgot about that. Hmm. But I think we needed to do it anyway. We can't afford to take that damage, so. No, that was a mistake. I should have blocked the other way around. Oh, well. Uh, okay, so we're at five. And we have six mana. An opponent would have to chump, but then would kill us. So that's bad. So we just attack, well, does he kill us anyway? This is the question. This can get to eight power. Four, six, eight, yeah, eight power, but it doesn't have trample. And, well, hmm. well, okay. So I think we just attack spirit here. So opponent is dead next turn and here's just an Oketra. Good luck. Here's where, oh, an opponent scoops. Didn't think they had it. I thought they would make me make the blocks. I thought that was a touchy situation, but okay. Uh, so they're aggro, so I want these for sure. And I think I actually want this too for ramp. I think we can take out, um, what can we take out? Probably this, no, that gains us life, that's good. What do we take out? Mm. This is a little slow. And I don't think this guy does enough. And Trusted Pegasus is not what we want to be doing. I think we also want Snare Spinners. I think we can take out this guy and one of these. Yeah. So that was a pretty in-depth sideboard. It's more than you normally see in limited, but I think we just have good options against aggro. And I think our opponent is certainly aggro. So this will be good. <laughs> Opponent is in the tank in the board. All right. What do we have here? This hand is bad. Um, yeah, it's pretty bad, huh? We really need to draw low drop creatures or this hand does nothing. The question is, is it better than a six card hand? Do we think we'll draw low drop creatures? 
I don't want to chance it. Yeah, that sounds way better. <laughs> like, by a lot. Uh, no. We have Oketra, we just need lands here. We have the 2-drop, 3-drop combo. It's... Life is but a dream. Alright. Play this. Opponent's still very aggressive. <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna go 2-drop, 3-drop. Go to town. Please don't have removal. How about that? That'd be great if you just didn't have removal. Nice. We don't have a third land. Yeah, I guess that's a problem. I kind of assumed I'd draw a third land in three draws, but uh, I guess not. Well, it's a lot less fun now. We draw a third land, we're fine. That's very scary. Ow. Land? No. Please. Ugh. Do we win this game by blocking this? I think we just do, so I think we just pass. This is so sad. We had such a good curve if we drew third land. Ugh. Hmm. Put it on the curve. I don't think we can afford to take all this damage. Probably on the first striker. Yeah. Still no third land. At least we got to play something, but this is, as they say, not great. Stays us for four this turn, assuming nothing else in hand. <sighs> Guy's big. Mm. Yay, third land. Okay, now what do we do? I think... It's just, like, not very good, is it? It's got so much power on board. <clears throat> okay. What most likely keeps us alive? Playing Grizzly allows us to block and kill this, chomp this, take four. Go to two. And then... Then what? I don't know. I don't know how we win this game. This makes this a three, four. Or 3-5. We still take 6 and die. So we just have to play this. This isn't looking great. I was so excited about that opening hand. I wish we'd drawn third land. It would have been great. Have to do it this way. Go to 2. Kill this guy, he gets a guy back. And he kills us, all right. That's rough, ugh. Still haven't gotten to play a Ketra, huh? In a lot of games, I won't tell you how many, in case you didn't watch the first video. Um, how many creatures do we have? Only 12. Maybe that's our problem. Hmm. <laughs> what if we take out this and put in this guy again? And take out... I want to gain this life though, it's really good. This and put in... Honestly, like, what if we just <laughs> go wild and put in a lot of low drops, though? Take out one of these, put in one of these. This is... 
This is kind of wild, but it gives us more creatures. Let's try it. I don't think it's that good, but let's try it. They certainly just aggroed us to death that last game, so. Sure, this is fine. We'll get to gain life, dig for a Ketra. We have the lands almost to play a Ketra. Opponent mulliganed, things are looking up. We have a three drop, we have removal. This is good. I'm ready. No one drop this time is nice. Like a raptor, even though it's not amazing here, we could maybe wait on it a little bit because we'll play the grizzly next turn. This is very, very fine. We'll play this. Can't attack us. I like it. No lands for opponent. That's sad for them. So I think we just uh, want to just turn the screws on them, right? Even though this... Yeah. This doesn't get to proliferate anything in this case. Um, but I think we just want to get as much threats on the board, as many threats on the board as possible while they're stuck on lands. All right, well, that didn't last long. Make a four, four, sure. Two, three, four, five, hmm. Well, what if we play Watley. And attack with everything. If they block, we Divine Arrow. If they don't block and they attack next turn, we Divine Arrow. So this is fine. Yeah, we don't need to use Watley yet. All right, things are going well. Still stuck on lands, it's pretty rough for opponent. I think they're gonna block this time. We will kill. Change the target of a spell or ability with a single target. Hmm. Interesting. Well, we'll do the grizzly thing then. It's actually pretty nuts for them. Jeez. Bolt bend. No one expects the one mana bolt bend. Jeez. My boy, let's go. Bulwark giant. My girl? Yeah, my girl. <laughs> so if they want, they get to kill Huatli. So the question is, do we want to just gain six? I think the answer is yes. I'd love to gain six. Thank you very much. Let me aid you. We have, as they say, a lot of life. And they are an aggro deck. So, this is good. Sure. Mm -hmm. That is fine. Here's, here's a dork that does nothing. 
which arguably we shouldn't have played in case we drew a Ketra. Um, yeah, let's just kill the flyer. Get rid of their clock. Just gotta outlast here. They have more cards. That's the scary part, but I think we can do it. There's a clock for us. So many cards. Hmm. Yeah, that bolt then was back breaking, dude. I thought we had the game when they got stuck on lands. Oh, this is also really bad. It's okay, I'll take the two cards. I'm looking for a Ketra. Good thing we have like a bajillion life, because we're gonna need it. <laughs> I am your inner demon. Seven. So we can play this. And then we can attack. I think we wanna attack Ob because it'll force them to kill Ob if they want to kill our creature. So if we play this, he'll ob it. We'll take two, then we'll take a bajillion. If we play this, he might not kill it. Hmm. We force him to ob it, make us draw two more cards, and then take a bajillion? Or do we play this, hope to bait out the ob on one of the weaker creatures, and then play that? What does it look like if he obs one of those creatures, though? It's pretty bad. This is equally bad, though, right? No, because then the next turn we get to play this and then block his whole board, right? He also has three cards in hand. This is not good. Do, 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 do. Does this do anything is the question, I guess. You know what? Whatever. We're going to play this. Force him to ob it. Make us draw two cards. Bolt bend, dude. Ugh. Hmm. Please, I would love an Aketra. That would be great. Thank you. Yeah, we're chumping here for sure, right? Eight, eleven puts us to thirteen. The reason we wouldn't is because we get counters next turn, or a counter that we then proliferate when we block with this guy later, right? So I think we just don't. Okay, now we can play everything, right? Yes, that's right. Okay, do we put the counter on the defensive guy or the offensive guy? This is the question. It's got to be this guy, right? Because we don't have enough of a clock, so. This guy doesn't block at all, so we'll definitely attack. Okay. Opponent just has infinity cards. 
and a very strong board and I'm very scared. Hmm. Mm-hmm, that's really good. Justice will be served, molten from the core of my soul. You brought this upon mm -hmm. yourself. That's not so great. All the dudes at first deck, right? Yeah. Ugh. We should not attack with this because we get to kill it. Okay. Block here. Block here. This guy gets bigger. Yes, I would like a big spider. Thank you. Land, huh? That's not going to do it. Draw 23 cards and we haven't seen a Ketra. That's pretty sad. Jeez. It's only tapped creatures. Yeah. Phew. All right. Well. The question is, does Oketra even save us at this point? I guess it depends. Ooh, that's good though. I'll take that. No attacks. <laughs> We're just trying to survive. This isn't even as good as I want it to be, right? Because all these guys have first strikes, so this doesn't kill them with death touch. Ugh! <sighs> okay, so we have to do some blocking, right? The question is, these guys have first strike, so we can't double block any of them, right? This guy, if he casts another spell, will get bigger and not die. So I think we want to prevent this damage for sure, because we'll kill him for sure. Then, I think we just chump chump, honestly. I think that's the best we can do, unfortunately. Why more lands? Why? Can I have Oketra? I would love an Oketra. All right. Um, I guess we just pass. This is sad. Have we used our removal this game? I think we did, right? Oof. Well, this is not going that well, I would say. <laughs> hmm. It's pretty rough, dude. Mm-hmm. We just dead. I think we're probably just dead, right? <sighs> we got a Ketra. I don't know if it's uh, in time to save us is the problem. Let's see. I guess it's up to opponent to make correct attacks. So let's see. This guy is also big.
Luckily, none of his things are big enough to tussle with Aketra, so that's nice at least. Um, Alright, so we're just going to play it, right? Of course. So my question is, what do we counter up? Um... Six. This makes this a four seven double strike, which is pretty scary. Makes this a two five. No, two four. Which I guess can do some blocking. Teamwork. Strength. No attacks. <laughs> I wonder if we're dead, like if opponent just alpha striked. We might be. 4, 8, 12, 17, 21, 22, 23, 28, 9, 30. Ugh. 34. And we can block. Not enough of it, probably. Okay, well, you're chumping this guy. I don't know if we're just dead. We're going to assign blocks and then see. <laughs> uh, we just need to prevent the most damage as possible. So the six power guy gets blocked. The five power guy gets blocked. The four power guy we can kill gets blocked. No, sorry. The five power guy gets blocked. And then the four power guy gets blocked. And we take four, eight, nine, ten. No, no, four, eight, yeah, geez. Well. That was rough. <laughs> Man, well. Sorry about the shorter video, but it is what it is. Sometimes you lose. Hey, we get a pack. We'll open the pack, see what we get. See if we get anything fun. Rare wild card, let's go. And Liliana. Neat. <laughs> well. That was rough. We'll see you next time. This has been Spike Games. Likes, subscribes, and comments. Always appreciated. I'm responding to every comment, so feel free to do that. And I will see you next time.